English 111 Reading 1 Chapter 6 Business Etiquette Text 2 Polite Behavior in Four Countries Chapter 6 Business Etiquette Text 2 Polite Behavior in Four Countries The first meeting with a new person, especially in business, can be very important. When you are in another country, do you know how to greet someone? How important is eye contact? Looking into the other person's eyes while you speak. How important is personal distance? The space between you and the other person. Here are some tips on polite behavior in four countries. Australia. People shake hands when greeting each other. It is the custom to shake hands at the beginning and end of a meeting. It is polite for visitors to introduce themselves in social situations. When you speak to an Australian, keep an arm's length distance from the person. Maintaining personal distance is important in this culture. Make eye contact with an Australian when conversing. Brazil. Brazilians usually stand very close to each other. Brazilians usually greet each other with long handshakes and eye contact. Close friends often hug. Hugging and back slapping are common among Brazilians, but they usually do not do this with foreigners. Brazilians often touch each other's arms, hands, or shoulders during a conversation. South Korea. In South Korea, don't introduce yourself. Wait for someone to introduce you to other people. South Korean men often greet each other with a slight bow and sometimes also with a handshake. Bow at the beginning and end of a meeting. Some Koreans believe that it's impolite to maintain eye contact with a person who has high status. In formal situations, Koreans usually do not touch each other's arms or backs during conversations. Touching is impolite with older people, people of the opposite sex, or people who are not good friends or family. Turkey. When you meet someone in Turkey, shake hands firmly. Friends and family often greet each other with either one or two kisses on the cheek. When you enter a room, if someone does not greet you first, greet the oldest person or the person with the highest status first. In social situations, greet the person closest to you, then move around the room or table counterclockwise. End of text 2